So the price action of QNT is getting squeezed into an apex here on the 4 hourly time frame. The bulls and bears are fighting. In this video I will talk about the support levels to hold, the resistance to break and I will also give you my longer term outlook. So we're starting off here on the 4 hourly time frame for QNT and we're looking at the price action from off the 10th of March. We have a potential impulse to the upside from off the 10th of March, a potential 5 wave move uh, which was yeah completed here on the 14th of march at approximately 134 since then we started to correct to the downside in a potential elliott wave 2 correction towards the low of the 27th of march uh, these uh, dates are perfectly in line with a lot of other altcoins since then we are we try to move to the upside again move down and right now we are struggling to break above this 200 day moving average here in orange on the four hourly time frame so yeah overall i'm still leaning towards the bullish scenario for q and t but what you can see is that we are below the 200 day moving average and we are also respecting this downward sloping resistance line we already got a few touch points we are also respecting this upward sloping support line so i can clearly see that the price is getting squeezed into an apex the bulls and bears are fighting here for the best price for q and t and um yeah it's getting very interesting guys this can still go on go on for a few more days that is a possibility this uh triangle will come to an end at the end of april so we need to uh, remain very patient here uh, eventually we will break out either to the upside or to the downside i'm leaning more to the upside uh, but what you can clearly see is that we are below the 200 day moving average in orange also here on the daily time frame so that is also not looking too strong at the moment but i have to say as long as the low of the 10th of march at 106 is holding we have an extremely high probability of still moving to the upside before we continue with the video i want to let you know about my trade signal group over the last few months our members have been extremely profitable with an average win rate of over 70 percent you don't need to have any special skills or knowledge to start if you're ready to take your trading to the next level join my signal group today and follow the steps in the description so let me give you the local areas of resistance to break um Let's actually draw out a FIP retracement from the swing high of the 20 of the 14th of March towards the swing low of the what was this of the 27th of March and you can actually see that uh, yesterday we got rejected here at the golden Fibonacci ratio at 127 that's a very important key area to break if we break above 127 guys then i do think that we have a confirmed breakout and then we could experience a massive rally for qnt so that's the important area to watch 127 let me also give you the support levels to hold for qnt so i'm going to draw out a fib retracement from the 10th of march towards the 14th of march and support to hold for qnt currently located at 120 dollars if we lose that level then there is an even stronger support level at 117 so those are the areas to hold if we lose those areas then we are going to drop much lower then we are probably going to take out the low here of 106 if we uh, break above 128 127 then we are most likely going to take out the high at 134 let's also take a look at the momentum Momentum on the 4 hourly extremely neutral at the moment. RSI sitting at 50. Momentum is also very neutral. Let's also check out the daily. Same story here. RSI at 50 uh, around the medium line. MACD also extremely neutral. So I think QNT is gearing up for a big price move. But as I said, we need to be patient because we can still... Uh, trade in within this uh, symmetrical triangle for a few more days before we are going to see that potential breakout so yeah let's also take a look at qnt against bitcoin to see uh, how strong or how weak we currently are so let's go qnt btc and let's check out where we are against bitcoin so yeah, from of, uh, June 2022, we have outperformed Bitcoin massively, as all of you guys are aware of. But from of the 19th of October 2022, we are underperforming against Bitcoin and we are also below the 200 day moving average here in orange we are approaching resistance uh, support the 0 0.786 uh, fibonacci level we are very close to that support level here against bitcoin so that could mean that this uh, correction against bitcoin could soon be over uh, you can also see that the value area low this blue line uh, it's indicating a lot of support at this region a lot of volume was transacted here and there are a lot of um 
yeah people willing to buy QNT at these areas so yeah if we drop lower watch out for this level um, against Bitcoin and at that point there should be some kind of a trend reversal happening for QNT because we have been correcting down against Bitcoin for a long time now and um, yeah we are getting very oversold also on the daily time frame let's check out the three daily as well here also very oversold against bitcoin so i think qnt is close to a potential rally against bitcoin uh but yeah i think we are not there yet we could still go for a few more days uh to the downside here so please like the video subscribe to my channel i want to thank you guys for watching and i see you in the next qnt update I'm trading most of my altcoins on BitGet. BitGet is a non-KYC exchange with some of the cheapest trading fees compared to other exchanges. If you sign up through my link in the description, you can claim up to 5,000 US dollars in bonus rewards and also 15% discount on all your trading fees and you support the channel as well. So make sure to check BitGet out.